guys, Homer's Hippo. Um, got another Candles by Victoria review. I got my August order. Um, sorry, I was just eating a Butterfinger. So I'm enjoying the little morsels. <laughs> um, I ordered in August because I did some work for my husband at his office. So he, I got him to pay me in candles. Um, so I just did a small order and I got it in today. Um, hopefully I can get this done in one to two parts because the iPhone only lets me upload 10 minutes and then it's too long and there's just problems. Um, yeah, sorry, I was going to try and get all pretty for you guys, but it's been a long day. <laughs> Kids were driving me bonkers. Um, so... Let's just hop into it. Sorry, I'm trying to put these in um, collections real quick so that way I can do all that are alike. Um, first ones I'm going to do are the black label ones. And I got a couple that were um, like the 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 fall cinnamon earthy ones that I thought I'd really like because I really like Alabama Slamma and I really like Moulin Rouge um, but I'm a spicy girl mm -mm. Um, I think I'm about to get interrupted by a bunch of Boy Scouts maybe <laughs> but my first one is Godfather this one's supposed to be the pumpkin-y spicy one um, This one, I, I definitely smell the the cinnamon and the spice and the nutmeg. And I get a little bit of the pumpkin and maybe some vanilla. This one definitely is a fall one. I get, um, it's kind of like yummy pumpkin pie. <laughs> Sorry, husband in the background. I'm like, don't make me stop the video. It's like it's like Thanksgiving. It's like a pumpkin-y, spicy, earthy pie. I can't wait to smell this one warm because I know it's going to be just amazing. If you don't like spice, I wouldn't suggest this one for you. Um, but I really like it because it's nice and spicy. Uh, Harvey Wallbanger. I think this is the one that people say is supposed to smell like juicy fruit gum or something. Um... I don't really get juicy fruit out of this. I get a fruity note and there's um <laughs> you're on candid camera <laughs> there's I get like a fruity note and the vanilla bean I think there's supposed to be vanilla bean in this sorry I'm I don't have the descriptions in front of me but I'm just telling you what I smell yeah, it, I don't get juicy fruit gum. I do get fruity, vanilla, maybe a little tiny bit of spice. Um, but I, I like that one. I'll see how it is when it's warm. I guess I have to show you this before I decide to take the thing off. Earthquake. My list was so big, I had to narrow it down. I didn't want to. Earthquake is yummy. Sorry, I got an itchy eye. It's been really dusty and smoky here lately. Mm. Yeah, this one's definitely spice. I think this is the one that's supposed to have like cinnamon and cardamom and something else and tapioca or rice pudding or something. And I really. I really like that one. It's very, it's another kind of Thanksgiving-y, win, not winter, Thanksgiving, uh, fall smell. Um, next I got three of the Diva Collection. I'll go with the one I broke into today. This is Bound to You. I think this is the Christina Aguilar one. And this one, I've got it going right now. It's really soft. It's not, it's not as strong as I thought it was going to be. Um, but I get like, I get the pink sugar in it. There's like an underlying note of pink sugar and some candy and fruit. There's, ah, there's a hard to describe note in it. Um, 
I'm get into bed. Sorry, mommy voice. Pink sugar. Oh, I think maybe it's like a cash the cashmere musk in this. But I do smell a musky and um like the pink sugar. So if you like pink sugar, you might you'll probably like that one. It's very light, very um very sweet. Next I got If you like it then you should have put a ring on it. If you like it then you should have put a ring on it. Oh 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 okay that's enough of that. Um this one, these colors on the Diva Collection are rich, amazing colors. Like this one, you can't even see it in here. It's like this burgundy, ruby beautifulness. I think this one is the one that you're supposed to smell white chocolate and chocolate in. And I think there's a musk in this one. Get into bed, Logan. But I don't smell any of the chocolate. I smell mostly musk. It's not bad musk though. It's like a soft powdery, a soft powdery musk with maybe a hint of some kind of spice and maybe vanilla. This one, it, it's really hard to describe, but it's very soft, a nice soft womanly scent. Next is the Kelly Clarkson one, Because of You. Now this one I was leery to get because of the cherry note in it, but this, it's like there's a drop of cherry in it. It's not, the cherry is not one of those, ew, cherry almond, kind of things. Um, I get a tiny bit of cherry. Logan, if I tell you to get into bed again, you're going to get a spanking. Sorry, mommy voice again. I'm not redoing this video. <laughs> I always do them like 15, 16 times because I have to stop because of kids. Um, anyway, back to the smell. It's supposed to be a cherry floral with a green leaf note in it. I think there was like roses and musk and cherry and but honestly it's kind of a, a slight green with a floral and I don't like florals I like this and there's just a hint of like a sugary cherry in there it's really good I really like that one um I'm trying to think how many I can get away with here can you hear him crying in his bed now uh next my free scent shot blueberry cobbler I love Victoria's blueberry scents. They're kind of like candied blueberries. They're sweet. They're yummy. Um, I've had blueberry monkey bed. Monkey bed. Woo. <laughs> um, I've had blueberry monkey bread and uh, blueberry flapjacks. This one I've put off getting for a little while just because I was afraid it was going to be kind of like the same, um, the same kind of thing. Oh, this is so heavenly. This to me so... Oh, smell the dough. Oh, this one is going to be really good burning. Um, it smells like... If you have jelly donut, it smells like the doughy jelly donut in that, but with blueberries. There's definitely a crusty, cobblery note in here so that it tones down the blueberry so it's not just in your face, overpowering, uh, sticky blueberries. Mm, I just imagine like a... Do I have wax on my nose? No. <laughs> I just imagine like this blueberry compote in a nice bubbling crust with dough that you just... buttery, flaky. Yum. Yum, 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 yum. Get that one. <laughs> Thank you, Victoria. That was a good pick. Nom, 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 nom. Oh, my mouth saw water. I'm going to have to take a drink of water. Okay, so I'm going to have to cut off here and hop over and do a second part because I only have like 30 seconds left. So I'll be right back. <laughs> 